thought love was only true in fairy tales Meant for someone else but not for me Love was out to get me That's the way it seemed Disappointment haunted all my dreams And then I saw her face Now I'm a believer And not a trace Of doubt in my mind I'm in love I'm a believer I couldn't leave her if I tried John Young, I'm Elizabeth, and I'm Jasmine. Welcome to Waka. It is September 21st, 2017. For lunch today, we have taco salad, peas, refried beans, a breadstick, and a banana. Coach Miller from Mishawaka High School will be in the cafeteria on Thursday, 9:21, to talk to anyone interested, seventh and eighth grade girls, about playing softball at Mishawaka High School. This meeting will take place during advisory. We will make an announcement to dismiss students to the cafeteria. The 8th grade Jags crushed Discovery Tuesday night, 28-0. to zero. The defense was held the Archers to negative 50 yards of total offense. Scoring for the Jags on offense were Aaron Frayling with two scores, Justin Fisher and Isaiah Chavez both scored once. Offensive Jag line dominated. Great job. On Tuesday, the cross-country teams hosted Schmucker and Northside at George Wilson. Although both teams lost, there were some good performances. Sarah Bashara led the girls, placing second overall, running in a time of 12 minutes, 33 seconds. Anna DeVries placed eighth, Anna DeVries placed eighth overall. Grace Zerbel, Marissa Rowe, and Caitlin King rounded out John Young's top five. Ryan Hoopagardner led the boys' team, placing in the top 10 of the field of 78. Luciano Gianuzzi was the second John Young runner to finish. Toby Quintana and Gabe Juarez and David Sharp rounded out JYMS top five. John Young Volleyball beat Pierre Mor Morin last night, 25 to 12, 25 to 22. Michaela Banks, Katie Baumgartner, and Seneca Zartman led the team with Serving Strong. Anna, Ava Raker, and Jada Leader play tough at the net. Good job, Jess. Seventh grade B team football took on Discovery on the gridiron last night in a game that had more momentum alternating plays than any one could count. The Jaguars ultimately succumbed to the Archers by the score of 13 to 12. Hometown Jags were led by the soft touch of Connor Putz who threw a touchdown pass to a wide open Bean Smith. The long legs of Malachi Carter also produced a touchdown late in the game that made Discovery call a timeout and talk things over. On defense, Sincere Harris was a man among boys and delivered punishing blows to the running back all, in game. all game. Good job, Jags. Flyers are in the main office about boys basketball fall camp. If you're interested, come grab one. The camp is October 7th, 2017 at the cave at Mishwaka High School for any third to eighth grade boy. Time's on the flyer along with other details. Have a great day. Bye. Bye.